Stretch your wings, Sunan. Eivor. Drengur. Suniva, thank you for coming. Ah, the sight of old friends lets my heart rest easy. We came as soon as we heard, bearing gifts for Hemming Gurjal. The celebration will last many days. How soon shall we begin? The pyre's construction is underway, and all of our guests are lodged and welcomed. We could begin shortly. Good. You handled this well, Trukve. I pledged my life's oath to Hemming Gurjal. There is nothing I would not do for him. The all thing must be held when the week is out and the funeral is done. The nobles of this shire will name Vili the Jarl of our clan. This assumes they will be sober after a week of drinking and weeping. It will be a grand funeral. Father will have a clear view of his lands from here. The flames will burn bright and tall for all the shire to see. You've done well, Trigve. This was his favorite spot in the shire. I suppose we should get started. Our guests need looking after. I will look for you later. To save you from them once the mead has really soaked in. You are a true gift, Eivor. Thank you. Trigvi is Hemthoth's rock. With him around, the city can keep its peace. He is a good man. I must be away for a short time, Eivor. I want to retrieve something for my father. A gift. When did you have the time to make a funeral gift? <laughs> It was something I had hoped to give him in life. You must see it to believe it. I brought a gift from the Raven Clan. I stored it at the Watchtower on the far side of Hemthorpe. Very kind, thank you. I should like to see it. I should look over the gift first. It must be worthy of hemming a Jarl. There's a heaviness to your look, Eivor. What troubles you? Hemming had desired my counsel before he died. Wanted my opinion on the future of this clan's leadership. That would be Vili, would it not? If tradition held, yes. Trikvi has tasked me to help the Volva with the sacrifices. Could we speak with her to ease your thoughts? It's a good idea. But let me go alone. Set scouts around the village. The people here must mourn in safety. See you, old friend. <laughs> With Heminger Yard gone, can Willy hold the reins? Will he guide us through? You are the wolf kissed one, the raven of battle whose fame grows with each waxing of the moon. I struggle with the choice Hemminger left for me. I would have your counsel on the matter. A slaughter must be made. Many sheep at the bottom of the sleeping Jutten, before the pyre is lit. Follow. Mm -hmm. 
Come, creatures. You are to serve the gods and bid them welcome our beloved Hemingoriak with ale and open arms. You have the gift of foresight, Seer. Can you argue what is to come? I see what need be seen, when it need be. A great gift. A great burden. Did Heminge Jarl consult you often? Did he unburden his woes? We spoke often. Yet too often he left with more burdens than he brought. He worried about the future of his clan. About who would be Jarl. Speak less. Lest our words draw foul spirits to dog us. As you wish. <sighs> Volva, I... Your heart is restless. Your mind clouded. You seek more than a guarantee of good omens. I seek the gods' wisdom. You wish to know who would best serve this clan as Jarl? I do. Between Vili and Trukvi, there's no clear choice. We stand in the shadow of the giant, the great keeper of secrets. Here, you'll find a drink of the resounding sea. Ascend the sleeping Jotun, consume the waters, and meditate at its peak. Do not seek answers to your questions. They will find you. This is the summit. Seek an answer, I should clear my mind and still my heart. Mingayal, is it truly you? Of spirit, not of flesh. Why have you not reached Odin's Hall? I've well in time. As the flames of my pyre burn, I will ride the path of wood smoke to the All Father's Hall of Champions. I am grateful to see you once more, Jarl. I struggle with the task you set before me. To choose your heir is not an easy thing. One man is beloved, but does not want the task. The other man is fit for the task, but is not favored. I could not give you any more counsel in life, A4. So too in death am I rendered silent. Forget wise counsel and rational arguments. What does your heart tell you? My heart is stopped. It says nothing. This should not be my decision, Heminger. The choice was always yours to make. You were their chief. As Sigurd is your chief. 
But that does not quench your appetite for glory as you covet his place upon the high seat of your clan. I do not seek to replace Sigurd. Fate weaved our futures long ago. We are only following its pattern. Yet you see it coming. You welcome it. Shall I renounce my fate then? Abandon the path to glory I walk? No. I want you to die in defense of it. This is not how I remember you. Too soon, Heming Ayal. You pushed me, Heminger. I never intended this. <laughs> have no regrets, Eifor. You have given me the great battle death I sought in life. You old fox. Was that the point of riling me up? You have seen what was needed. I have more than enough. Sure. This is an outrage! Festive. Too festive. And too soon. Fires, fights, and every man soaked in mead. Ugh, this has gone too far. Hemthorpe could burn before the pyres lit. Gods, have I failed, my dear Jarl? Peace, Trukvi. I will do what I can to calm things. Play Bob Clefty! What? How dare he insult our culture? He's a dead man if I ever get my hands on him. Help! Fire! Save my... What is this boda you speak of? A gift without price, fit for a Jarl's lips. But hurry, it catches flame. Help! Fire! Save my food, it burns! This is your Voda. I managed to save it from the licking flames. You dared Surtur's heat, yes! A most potent drink, distilled from grain by the Rus of Kiev. 
Dip your horn and have a drink. A bit of drink in the belly never hurt. Watch yourself. The Voda sneaks up on you quick. Survey the area, Sudan. Someone get that drunk away from the chickens. Save back. Flee, warrior, flee. Loki's horde lays waste here. You mean Hemminger's famous fighting roosters? Dragons with mighty claws. Thank you, mighty Thor. You've saved my life. Uh, when you sober up, steer clear of roosters. I didn't see them coming. I never looked down. I never saw them coming. Be my eyes, Sunan. Come out, you dung eating rat! What madness is this? You dare wash our beloved Hemingir with your filth! I asked you a question, friend. There's a Saxon within. One stupid enough to try sending Hemingir to heaven over Valhalla. Now he cowers behind a locked door! I only did right by his immortal soul! You will get what is right for you! Calm yourselves, all of you. I will speak with him, unmask his true intentions. Get that stain out here now! <sighs> the people are quite upset. Leave me be! I did nothing wrong! You should walk out of here on your own, before you cannot walk at all. Yes, yes, I'll walk, I'll walk. Don't hurt me, please. There's a key there. If you open the door, I... I will follow you out. Oh, my God! You've got the key! Use it! Get that stain out here now! You pay for your wrongs, desecrator! Enough. Let him speak to explain himself. I loved Heminger. I swear. I only want him to fly free in the kingdom of God. So you drench his body with your filth waters? Was it your Christian holy water? Of course. I anointed him in the name of the Lord. Never inflict your Christian mysteries on a dead Norseman. But I only... These are your neighbors. Respect them. Learn their ways. And you will draw breath long into old age. Oh, no! There you are. Baptized as one of us. Some order seems to have been restored. Now to trick me, to let him know. I've calmed the guests as much as they can be in their grief. They mourn. It is to be expected. Still, thank you. And how do you feel, old friend? I mourn more deeply than most, I think. Heminger would be proud of what you have accomplished here. All you have done for him. I hope so. This ache will pass, Trukvi. 
a time. Yes, it will. This is an excellent shield, Suleiman. Gunnar's crop. And here, from the Raven Clan. An impressive shield. It is good. But it needs a touch of grandeur. Something personal for your father. A sigil, I think. A mark to adorn the front. We need an artisan. Is there one in the village? I know a man. A master craftsman in exile. He lives in a cave northeast of Hemsop. I would take you there myself, but I have Isbjorn to retrieve. Isbjorn? Your father's spear? Did he not wield it at Ulkerthorpe? He lost it some winters back on a bear hunt. He hit the beast hard, but the spear stuck and the bear fled into the forest. And after all these winters, you hope to find it again and present it to the pyre. The odds are narrow, to say the least. <laughs> Fret not, friend. I have a nose for these things. Seek out the exile. He'll see to your shield. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is an excellent shield, sir. Mm -hmm. Gunnar's craft never disappoints. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Exile must value his solitude, living in a hole such as this. Beard. You are a difficult man to find. Uh. Hemminger Jarl is dead. Mm. I was told you are a master craftsman. I seek an etching on the shield to celebrate the life and death of Hemminger Jarl. The stones. Hemminger Jarl possessed a steady hand and steady heart. Do you possess the same? Could it be at such a time? 
Emminger Jarl's heart never wavered. Who are you? A friend of Hemminger's? Or a man exiled by his order? It does not matter who I was. I am nameless now. I am no one. You have not yet answered me. Will you help me with my etching? How will you remember him? By his unrivaled prowess on the battlefield. Ah, Gunknir then. Odin's faultless spear, a symbol of power. Is this your choice? I still... By his wisdom, always an inspiration. The web of Wyrth, then. Nine lines that write our fates. Past, present, and future entwined. Is this what you'd... I... By his deter... The mark of vague Visir. Sights never lost. Is this your... I... By his unru... Ah, is this your... Yes. I will begin. How did you come to be here? Fate. I was given a death sentence. Unfairly, I felt. But a man was killed. Hemminger Jarl desired for me to live. The villagers did not. My sight and exile. That was our compromise. Thank you for this. His son will take his place? That is for Billy to decide. Billy has no say. Fate has already decided. The old thing is tomorrow, and the Jarl must be chosen. I should speak with Sunimer about this. <laughs> 